I've been a secretary for half a century. It's not as exciting as my last job. The Beatles needed a secretary. I just couldn't believe that I was starting my dream job, working for the Beatles. The Beatles were together 10 years. Fido, she was there right before they made it and right after they finished. On behalf of us all, I'd just like to say a great big thank you to our secretary, Frida Kelly. Hello, Frida! Silly me, I gave out my home address as the fan club address and the van rolled up. I was very naive. Once I joined the Beatles organisation, I grew up overnight in more ways than one. I was out with Paul, walking somewhere. Somebody saw us, and then it was, you know, I was marrying Paul. They got a quote, Paul McCartney is not marrying Frida Kelly. Somebody sent a pillowcase in and said, can you get Richie to sleep on it? I remember saying to his mum, can you make sure he sleeps on it? Frida was far more than a secretary uh, to the Beatles. She was a family member. It was all fun when we were teenagers, but your life changes. Well, obviously, we can't keep playing the same sort of music. It wasn't what the Beatles were doing as a group anymore. It was what they were doing individually. Is the atmosphere today anything like it was 10 years no, ago? No, What's missing? The closeness. This story of Frida Kelly's will be one of the last true stories of the Beatles that you'll ever really hear. I don't know why they picked me. Maybe it was just fate. I was taken along for this 10-year exciting ride. I was, and still, a Beatle fan. Did you go out with any of them? Pass. <laughs> no stories there. Oh, there is stories, but I don't want anybody's hair falling out. <laughs>